Good evening, everyone. A state employee has been arrested following an incident in the Capitol earlier this week. News 3's Jessica Arp joins us live from the Capitol with more on the charges. Jess? Well, an arrest and misdemeanor charges are coming out of a bizarre altercation at the Capitol on Monday where a state employee allegedly popped a balloon. Building manager Ron Blair, an employee with the Division of Facilities, was arrested by Capitol Police and charged with misdemeanor endangering safety by use of a dangerous weapon. Blair confirmed to News 3 Monday he was involved in the incident and late today, Capitol Police confirmed he was the employee arrested. On Monday, blood spattered the ground outside the state Supreme court where a protester says Blair stabbed a balloon she was holding and then when she confronted him he allegedly slammed her against a bathroom door. The Department of Administration said Blair cut himself on the way to confront her about the balloon leading to the blood on the ground but the woman was not injured. Protesters have been bringing balloons to the Capitol as part of a daily sing-along in the rotunda. Blair had no comment when reached by phone by News 3 today. He is now on paid administrative leave while the state conducts its own investigation into what happened here. The charges will now go to the Dane County District Attorney's Office where they will review it and decide what charges to ultimately file in the case. But tonight on News 3 at 9 and 10, we'll hear from the woman who was involved in the case and on what she believes should happen next. All right, Jessica Arp, live at the Capitol. Jess, thanks.